Hi everyone, welcome to your channel Ochareo. This video is about the Odun Obara e Irala Chebora Obara Trupo Inifa Elegua Ogun Osain Orumira Chango Top in this Odun. It's so important for you from time to time to clean your house with the Umiero with El Os Obatala like frescura, algodón, prodigiosa, bledo blanco, antiponla, because this is the hot odum. But also you need to be careful with your kids, because in this odum Ayakwa had a daughter, and she grew up so beautiful. And then Ayakwa didn't have a relationship for a long time. So one day he decided to raise his own daughter. But after that, he was looking to blame someone for it. So he did the above with a lot of pawn and put it next to the tree. The rooster that was around there, he saw the corn and he started to eat it. So the Ayakwa took advantage of this moment and started to yelling to everyone. So everyone approached to that place. And then saw the rooster and they blamed the rooster for that and punished him. So in this order, it's important that you take care of your kid. Don't allow them, for example, to go to places that you don't know, sleep over, and even with the family because they can be raised for someone that at some point lose their mind. Something else is that it will be a trauma for the kid. So the kid are supposed to play with the kid. Sometimes we are in a party that everyone is drinking and then the children are around and you never know the mind of the person. You are supposed to be careful too because someone could blame you that you raped his daughter or his son without any reason and you could be in court and have problems with the justice. So in this order, it's important that if you had a young daughter, for example, you take to the school, try to always open your eyes because this order talk about the rape with the children. This order also talk about the relationship because here, a guy, he wants to get married with the daughter of the king of that village, but a lot of people were against him. So one day he decided to go for a reading with Orumila, and Orumila, he saw this order and recommend him to do an ebo with Echu and Elegua. But he did everything like Orula recommend him. And then after that he said, I'm going now to look for her because I had the house that I bought already in the city. But Echu recommend him, don't live in the city because over there you have a lot of enemies. It's better for you that you live in the countryside. So he followed up the recommendation of Echu and he said, okay, I'm going to live outside the city. He went to see the king and the king gave him the hand of his daughter, and they then got married and were so happy. But what happened that all the enemies got together, and they spoke with the army in order to attack him. But Echu and Elegua, that he did the above with them, they advised him and told him, we go to help you. So as soon the soldiers show up, they prepare a big trap for all of them and they defeat the army. So he started to live a beautiful life with his wife. So this ought to recommend you that do not listen anyone that talk with you against the relationship that you have, even a family member. It's important to attend Echu and Elegua at the same time. You can't do the above for example, with young, for both of them, to clean in front of them with fruit, 
and offer always something to make them happy because they go to help you to defeat any enemy that you have around. You have to be careful with the people because in this ordnum, the king, he had the servant that was Aya, and he told him and taught him about all the secrets that he had in Paris. But also Elegua knew about all of them. And one day, Elegua took Aya with him to his house. But he saw that Aya started to get angry and he refused to do a lot of things in his house. So Elegua said, he gave my enemy. So he didn't want to let know anyone because he said he know all the secrets of this kingdom and he could create a lot of problems around the village with a lot of people. But he that knew the king, they had a great communication with the songs. So Elegua started to sing and the king noticed the problem that Elegua communicate through the songs. So he organized a big party with all the king of the village around. And then Ogun, Chango, Osain, Babalua, Ye, and others went to the party. But one of them had a lot of knowledge and different power. So Aya got close to him and started to talk with him in secret. Elegua, that was watching him, told Chango and Osai, look at him. He's telling some secrets to that man that he doesn't know us. So Osai and Chango told him, don't worry, we go also to watch him to know what he's doing. So later, when the king left, they saw how Aya followed him to his kingdom. And Chango and Osai told Elegua, don't worry about that. We're going to prepare a food with some air with Osai and meat. And then we're going to put in his way. Later, because he was walking a lot in his way to the other palace, Aya saw the food and ate all of that. And he got so sick and got a lot of pimples in his skin. So when the other king saw him in front of his door, told him, I don't want you here because you can contaminate my kingdom. And then put him out of his kingdom. So at that moment, Elegua, Chango, and Osain show up and told him, You see, you are a traitor. And Ogun said, Don't worry about it. I go to take care of him. And Ogun sacrificed Aya. So this old is he letting you know that you are not supposed to eat in any place that you don't know the people. Because you never know. If you have a dog that, for example, you have before you count the orchard and you have this order to take care of it until he passed away, but to avoid to have dog in your house. Something else is that you are not supposed to let know anyone about your secrets. Because later if the person becomes your enemy, know everything about you. This is the album that you are supposed to feed Chango with two rooster and also reinforce your ogun. Something else is that when you have a business, for example, if someone talk with you about a business, you need to be careful and be sure that this business is legal because you could have problems with the justice. This is the album Obara Eyirala Chebora that is prosperity for the person, but it's hard on you. So you need to keep your eyes open. When you get a chance also, you can refresh, for example, Chango with fruit and elegua in order that they help you with anything. If you have, for example, someone that misses your house, check the luggage because in the luggage could be something illegal and you could be in trouble with the justice. So something else is that try to cook the meat as well as you can. Be careful with the candle in the house, with the stove, 
because boy, this is one of the old books that talk about fire. So be careful with all of that to avoid accidents in your house. Thank you all of you for joining us. Here you are two videos about the Odu of Bara to improve your knowledge about this Odu. Leave your comment below and like, subscribe to this channel to receive notifications of the new videos and live stream. Health, faith and prosperity. That's what Oh, chareo.